Uh, hi, hi everyone, Pac-Man here. Uh, I just want to give you a quick tutorial on ground vessel and how to create one. A working one, not just a gimpy one. <laughs> this is alpha, pre-alpha 2.0.2, so things can change. We are in creative mode, so I can just show you without having to grab everything on my own. But I mean, it's just, it's just a tutorial, it's just a tutorial, guys. So, what we will need, and I will put everything in the description for you. So, if you want to just skip the video itself, that's fine. Uh, look in the description and just check out exactly what materials you need to create it, that's fine. But I'll just show you once we got all the uh, nitty gritty stuff, we will need a ground vessel starter, an RCS, a cockpit, a normal thruster, just one. It just comes in five because that's how the creative thing works. We'll need three uh, directional thruster, one generator, and one fuel tank, and some hull blocks. So, I mean, first to get started, just plop that sucker down, and it's just gonna pop right down if you look at it. The arrow is pointing at where the uh, vessel is going to go. Now, for me, I just wanna make it a little bit bigger so we don't have to be cramped in there, so I'm just gonna put like, uh, just three rows here. And you don't, you don't have to worry, there we go, if the cockpit covers the, uh, that box, so you don't have to worry about it. So you just plop it right there. So that's your cockpit. Next is the RCA. You can put it anywhere. Uh, next, I just want to put the generator and the doop, 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 doop. Uh, what is this? Uh, fuel tank. Plop it right there. So that's what we have now. Actually, if we just put this guy down. Uh, there we go. If we put this guy down, we can actually just turn it on. Why? Boop. And, you know, it'll go, but it won't go backward, it won't stop, it won't do anything. So you just gotta shut it off. And look, that's what happened. Because we don't have any directional thrusters. So that is where this guy comes in. You'll want to put one on each side. Uh, it looks really stupid, but I mean... It works, guys, so... And, of course, one here, so you can actually thrust back. Come on. There we go. So now, when you hop in, press Y to turn on. You can go forward, you can go backwards, and then you can move side to side. So that is the bare minimum you need to make a running uh, ground vehicle. Now, the advantages of a ground vehicle is that it takes a lot less fuel, less power source. So if you just hop on out... Uh, do, 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 do. Ah, well, it's already gone, but... It takes a lot less uh, to power this sucker, so... That is why I chose a ground vessel instead of a... You know, one of those hovercraft, or the other ones, the flying ones. Okay. What else is that? This is the bare minimum, like I said. If you do want to add more, and I encourage you to, uh, the best thing to add would be an oxygen station. <laughs> oxygen station and an oxygen tank is great. And I mean great for if you want to go further. I know, this is going to look silly, but... Uh, <laughs> It's, it's only for show, guys. Only for show. Uh, this will be great for if you need to go exploring after you get out of your ship. So you can just go in and go and then get your oxygen from here. See? There it goes. So, I really encourage you to get an oxygen tank. The next thing would be a small constructor, which, I mean, it's not really needed. But, I mean, if you're going far, far away and... Ah, there you go. God, it looks so silly. If you're going far away and you need to just, you know, uh, make some ingots, ingots while you are doing other things, you know, this this will do. This will work. So when you get back home to home base, you have everything right there, ready to process into something else. So I think that's. I mean, you can also create these too, which is which is great. So that is why I recommend that. Another thing, of course, would be. The cargo box because 
you know, if, if you've got a big hull, I mean, you find like a huge, crazy uh, ship that has tons of stuff, you're not going to be able to carry it all. So, just stick it in a container. Easy peasy. And last thing is very, very optional is the fridge. So you can store more. Oh God, <laughs> look how much stuff I'm packing in here, guys. But uh, yeah, the last thing would be a fridge. Just so, you know, you can keep like steaks and salami and whatever you feel like cooking. And there. So that is it, guys. Oh, that looks like a very terrible looking ground vessel, but it works. It works. And it will go wherever you need to go. And look at that. You've got 236 minutes of power left. I mean, if you saw, it was like 800, but with all the necessities and the... Not even necessities, this is luxury stuff now. <laughs> that we put on there. I mean, it, it, it got a little bit more um, fancy, so it's taking up a little bit more power. But still, still. I mean, this is it. This is uh, the ground vessel. So, thank you guys for... Oh, look, I'm <laughs> on a rock. Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. And I'll come up with some more fun uh, tips and hints. But for now, this is a tutorial. And this is Pac-Man, signing out.